I'm Netta Taufik in New York, and this is BBC World News America. The climate summit is pushed into overtime with emotions running high. Negotiators try to tr strike a deal on how to combat rising global temperatures. We'll have the latest. With thousands of migrants stranded on the border between Belarus and Poland, we look at the dangers they face caught in freezing conditions and a burning political row. A grand jury has indicted one of Donald Trump's former top aides. Steve Bannon had refused to cooperate with a congressional committee investigating the January 6th Capitol riots. And a new injection helps paralyzed mice walk again. Could it lead to a breakthrough for humans? We have the story. Welcome to World News America on PBS and around the globe. The UN Climate Summit in Glasgow, known as COP26, has now passed its scheduled finishing time. But delegates and negotiators are continuing to work through the night to try to come to an agreement about what steps the world must take in order to combat climate change. A third draft is being worked on to replace the last one. All the while, hundreds of activists are marching through the summit venue, complaining that the proposed actions don't go far enough. Our environment editor, David Shookman, is in Glasgow and has this report. <laughs> 